Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your Bitly account and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you change the Bitly URL destination link? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to change the URL destination to your Bitly link anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're doing affiliate marketing or you're running an online business, you know that sometimes the affiliate offer or landing page that you need the Bitly link to point to has changed. And instead of changing every single Bitly link, you can actually change the destination. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Bitly account. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I've already logged into my Bitly account and this is the home screen. Now, before we go any further, I want to let you know, in order to change the URL destination for your Bitly account, unfortunately, that is a paid feature. If you have the free version, you can't do that, at least not at the time of the recording of this video, unfortunately. But if you have the paid version and you'd still like to go ahead and update the URL Bitly destination, what you're going to do is here on the left side, you're going to click on this button here called links. It looks like a little chain link. Okay, so once you do that, you're going to see all of the different Bitly links that you have. So you can see I have three right here. So you just need to go ahead and scroll through until you find the one that you want to change the Bitly URL destination. So for example, this one right here, this one points to my YouTube channel. So what you're going to do is over here on the right side, you're going to click on this little pencil icon. Okay, guys, so here is where you can go ahead and update the Bitly URL destination. So here is the Bitly link right here. And then here is where it sends the person once they click on this Bitly link. So all we're going to do is click here on redirect this blue button next to the link. Okay. So they do give you a warning. If you have any QR codes associated with this, it's going to redirect for that QR code along with the Bitly link. If you're okay with that, go ahead and click on yes, continue. Okay. So here's where we can go ahead and redirect the URL destination. So for example, this is going directly to my YouTube channel. So maybe I want to go ahead and direct it directly into a YouTube video. So let me grab a video over here. Okay. So here is a recent video right here. So I'm going to go ahead and click here, share and copy that link. Okay. So I'm going to jump back here. All right, here we are back in the Bitly account. And all we're going to do is just go ahead and highlight the whole thing. And I'm going to paste right over it. We're going to highlight it, delete it, and then paste in the new link. So now the URL destination to my Bitly link will go directly to that one video, not to my channel. So I'm going to click on redirect. Okay. Next, you're going to see this confirmation saying that your URL destination for that link has been redirected and it confirms right here. And if you want to go ahead and make sure that it's going to the right place, just highlight this right here or click on copy link. I'm sorry. Don't click on copy link because that's going to copy the bit.ly highlight this portion right here. This is the URL destination. And then you can go ahead and paste it into a new tab. Okay. I pasted it into the new tab and you can see it just brought me directly into this one video. So let me go back to my bit.ly. All right, let me close this down. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to redirect or change the URL destination for your bit.ly link, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.